In this video, I will show you how to add clickable links in YouTube video description. This should be a quick and easy tutorial to follow, but before we do continue, please consider leaving a like on the video and also subscribing to the channel. I really do appreciate it. Here we are on YouTube, and this is the video that we'll be using as an example today, which is called how to turn off vibrant visuals in Minecraft Bedrock. Now, in order to add some clickable links to this video, what you're gonna to want to do first is make sure that your channel is eligible to add clickable links. To do that, come up to the top right hand corner, click on your profile icon, and on this menu that comes up, come down and click onto YouTube Studio. Once you're in your studio, come across to the menu on the left hand side and come and click onto settings in the bottom left hand corner. And on the settings window that comes up, come across to the menu on the left and click onto channel. Then what you want to do is come up to the top. You can see we've got some different options up here. What you want to do is click on to feature eligibility and make sure that you have enabled intermediate and advanced features. Now, once you've enabled advanced features down here, it tells you how to do this. As you can see, we've got requirements on the right hand side. And once you've done that, as you can see, you'll be able to add external links in video descriptions. Once that's been done, what you want to do is close this down and just find the video that you want to add some clickable links to. In our example, that was this one here, how to turn off vibrant visuals in Minecraft Bedrock. And then what you want to do is click onto the pencil icon to go into the video description and details. Then what you can do is add some clickable links. As you can see, I've added a couple down here already. One thing to note, which is very important, is when you add a clickable link that you do put the HTTPS, then the code on, and then need the to slashes like this. If you just simply put the web address, so say for example, amazon.com, without the HTTPS code on and the two forward slashes at the start, it's not going to become a clickable link. So of course, once you've made your changes, be sure to come up to the top right hand corner, click on save to save your changes. As you can see, that's now been done. If I actually go ahead and now play this video, so what I'm going to do is pause that and come to the video description below. So if I actually make this now bigger and you can see all the ones with HTTPS and now clickable links, they're highlighted blue. You can see the example I added where I've just put Amazon.com is not a clickable link. So the important thing to note is that you have verified your account in your YouTube channel settings so that you are eligible to add external links. And of course, once you are adding your links, make sure you do put the HTTPS code on forward slash forward slash to make the link clickable. So that is how to add clickable links to YouTube video description. With that being said, I hope this quick tutorial did help you out today. And if this did help you out, I would really appreciate it if you was to consider dropping down below the video, leaving a like, and also subscribing to the channel. With that being said, I just want to take a minute. Thank you guys for watching this quick tutorial, and I will see you in the next video.